Hi everybody, it's Crafting Just Because with Chris Carolyn. And today we are playing with the Cactus Cuties Bundle. And it's uh, got a, stamp, or a punch in the, in the stamp set, which is photopolymer. And we're going to create a cute little gift bag. So let's go ahead and get started. We're first going to start with a piece of Evening Evergreen cardstock. And we need this cut at seven by nine and a half. So we're gonna cut nine and a half, and then at seven. And then on the nine and a half inch side, we wanna score it at three and a quarter. At four and a half. at seven and three quarters and at nine. And then we're gonna rotate it 90 degrees and score it at one and a quarter. Okay, and then we wanna cut a couple other things here really quick. Um, let's see here. I'm going to cut some designer series paper and I'm going to go ahead and cut this piece and I want it three inches. Let me make sure my measurement is correct. I kind of lost my train of thought there. Yeah, three inches and I'm going to do by five. Okay, and then I'm going to cut another piece that's just slightly smaller here. And I'm going to do two and three quarters. by four and three quarters. Okay. And then that's all the cutting we will need to do on our trimmer. So I'm gonna go ahead and move that away. I'm gonna bring in our cut and emboss machine. That's the mini. And we are going to die cut out um, a shape from the Tasteful Labels. I've got some new pads here, which is kind of exciting. Okay, where is my... Sorry guys, I thought I had a scrap. I'm gonna do it out of mint macaron. We just need to move this out of the way. And let me put that label back. And I'm sorry, I am gonna bring in um, my paper trimmer one last time as I want to score this in half. So let's see here. I'm gonna do it at one and one eighth, just like that. OK. 
Okay. And then I'm just going to cut this off while I have it right here. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to bring in our bone folder and we're going to fold and burnish all the score lines. And then on the side that has the half inch tab, we're gonna cut this little rectangle out and tab the sides. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut up the score line and cut that off and then cut that off. And then next I'm gonna cut up each of the score lines to that intersecting score line. And I'm gonna wedge on the square. And what that means is I'm just taking a tiny bit out just so that it folds up nice and neat. And then before we start assembling that, I do want to take a moment, excuse my reach here, I'm going to grab a couple ink pads. I'm going to use Calypso Coral, Evening Evergreen, Pear Pizzazz, and some Mint Macaron. And we're going to come in with our stamp set and a scrap of basic white paper. And I'm going to go ahead and let's get, I'm gonna do the big cactus there. And I'm just gonna use the clay pot right underneath it here. So I did that in Calypso Coral, and then I'm gonna do the big cacti in Pear Pizzazz. some of these leaves in the evening evergreen. And then I do wanna do one last piece here and I'm gonna do one of these smaller pieces. Let's see here. In the mint macaron. Okay, so that's kind of light. Oh, sorry if I got off camera there when I was stamping. So those are the pieces that I stamped. And then we're going to fussy cut those out really quick. Because the pieces that I did don't match up with the stamp set. So I'm going to go ahead and... Um, Bussy cut these out and there I picked simple ones to cut out and I just like to use a little bit of or you know do a little bit of a border and then we'll assemble our project all together so there's that piece
there's that piece. We have two more to go. And then we'll be all set. I think this set is so cute. I have a night. I just want to make all kinds of cute things with it. And then our last little piece here. It's probably hard to see because Mac Macaron's a very light color. Okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to put tear and tape here on the edge. Take off that release paper. And then I'm going to fold this over just like that. Then this is my front. So I'm going to put that tab down. I'm going to put the back one in first. And then I'm going to just use my liquid multi purpose glue and glue this down. Just like that and then we'll glue this part down and then I'm going to put it on its side or on its bottom and run my bone folder in there okay I'm just going to kind of pinch in the sides next we're going to fold and burnish our little label here and then let's adhere our layers together and what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that evening evergreen piece and I'm gonna do I hope your day is on point. And I'm going to stamp that right at the bottom. Just like that. And then we're gonna kind of put together our little cactus here. So I'm going to I'm gonna put dimensionals on the pot, okay, so that that kind of stands out. And then what I was thinking was I was gonna have this kind of coming out the side. So I'm gonna go ahead and put glue on the back of that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and glue my cactus down. Right in the center there. And then I'm gonna put down my pot And I'm going to also glue down this little leaf piece that I cut, kind of just hanging off the side there. Okay, now I'm gonna adhere this to the front of my box.
and it's not going to go all the way up because remember you're going to have this little closure here okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to glue it i believe in the in the inside oh no i think i need to glue it on the outside so i'm going to glue the half to the outside and i'm going to use tear and tape just because that's nice and strong so i'm probably going to put a couple pieces down okay and then we're also going to need a velcro dot so i'm just getting that out here You know what while I have this all on let's just go ahead and put the velcro dot down take off the release paper so I'm first going to attach the back to the back just lining up on that crease line. Just like that. Okay. Then I'm going to seal it shut with my finger and press that Velcro dot down. And there's your Velcro dot. Okay. And now one last thing is we're going to add some pale papaya ribbon to that top flap. And I'm just going to tie it in a bow. Oh, I've got tape everywhere. Okay. And I'm just going to take some ribbon scissors. Oh man, I messed that up. Okay. And then I'm going to put a dab of glue right onto where my ribbon is. going to put my bow down and I'm going to attach it with a little clip while it dries. Just like that. And that's our project for today using the Cactus Cuties bundle. I hope you guys had fun crafting with me today and until next time my creative peeps, I will see you later. Bye-bye.